So, quick update on the walls. There she blows. Well, doesn't blow at the moment. And this is how I install it. It's located over there. The exhaust is there and goes through the aft over there. The air ducts are these black ones. Which one of those I drilled a hole through the cock uh, cockpit floor and the other one to the uh, aft bunk and that's installed straight to the bulkhead and let me get you guys inside just a moment I'll lock up the place because reasons I don't want to get my gas stolen so let's go inside and I will show you what is going on. So, as I have showed you before, the controller is over there, which works just fine. You can uh, see the vent over here. This is the uh, vent that went through the bil below the cockpit floor and came over here. The other one is located back there. And I don't want to switch it on right now, but it works just fine. And that's about it. <laughs> Sorry for not making any content. I have been super busy at work and well, that work <laughs> takes almost all the time in the world at the moment we have so many projects going on but soon in a few weeks i will raise up this boat and bring it home to my house and keep it there for the winter i think perhaps perhaps not never know but thanks for watching and sticking around i love you guys 300 subscribers that's awesome well 298 but anyway it's nice and this is how the boat looks like inside of them hey now uh, since we are in here i will show you one update that i made and it's in the front cabin and it's the ikea leds those lead strips and I installed those ones uh, because of uh, the other LEDs that I have over there they are way way too bright and too uh, white I like this uh, illumination much better it shows well <laughs> it looks much nicer and it doesn't get you that operating room feeling. And yeah. But that's all the updates for now. I will bring you guys back for the last sale of the season which will be in few weeks. And Scramasox, I haven't forgotten you. Thanks. That was awesome part that you sent for me.